Morning Tesoro. Welcome to TNN. I'm Melissa. I'm Sandy. And I'm Kathan. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Seniors, next Friday is the Senior Luau. Don't forget to purchase your tickets for $12 in the ASB office. If you bought a class package, it was included. You won't want to miss out. Attention sophomores, this Friday during tutorial, there is a mandatory meeting in the theater for AP US History. Don't forget about it if you are taking this class. Are you interested in going to Catalina for the day? Well, you're in luck because Ms. Holland is taking not only freshmen, but anyone who wants to go on June 14th. It'll be $105, including everything you will need. Today is the last day to sign up, so see her in room 801 by 3 p.m. for more details. That's all I have for my portion of current events. Now over to Sandy for the rest. Thanks, Melissa. Future AP Psych students, if you signed up for Psych for next year, you are in. There is no meeting this year as the homework is easy to understand. Please go to Mrs. Woodward's website and you will find all the homework in her locker. Better get started. Choir auditions for 2014-2015 are held in the choir room Monday, June 9th and Tuesday, June 10th after school. Sign up for a five minute slot in the choir room. You can talk to Mr. Hancock for any more details. Graduation tickets are now on sale in the ASB office for $7 a piece. Each ticket must be purchased with cash or credit card, no checks. Anyone over the age of five needs a ticket. Tickets can be purchased at the gate and tickets must be, tickets at the gate must be with cash and there will be, there will be lines. Last day to purchase tickets is June 20th. Senior breakfast is June 21st. Make sure to have a great time. Seniors, this is the last time you will see each other, so make sure you go and you will be receiving your caps and gowns at this time. Okay, um, and guess what time it is, everyone? It's my favorite segment of TNN. That's exactly what I'm talking about, our music reviews. Check it out. Hi, this is Anthony reporting from Room 913 with your Titan Music Reviews. And today we are reviewing the new Owen Pallet record in conflict now. Owen Pallet is a composer, uh, chamber pop, baroque pop. Uh, this guy has composed every, or from everyone to uh, Arcade Fire and The National to Taylor Swift. This guy's had a wide range, worked with a wide range of musical talents and tastes. Now. Uh, this album has a lot of beautiful, big uh, orchestral instrumentation from the strings to the horns to even some electronics thrown in there, some electronic synths. Now, Owen's voice has this quieter, more calm quality on most of the tracks, but a really standout track where Owen really does shine is the track The Riverbed, where uh, he really reaches into those uh, high points in his voice and delivers this really powerful performance. Uh, definitely one of my highlights off this record. So. I'm Anthony from Room 913 with your Titan Music Reviews. You know, I find a lot of the things that he reviews are actually pretty interesting. I still need to look up a lot of them. Yeah, I, I think the best part of that album is definitely the horns, so. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> all right, well, everyone, that's all I have for my portion of current events. Now over to Kathan with sports. Thanks, Andy. The only athletes that are still participating in athletics are Amanda, Mitchell, and Trey, all from track. They will be competing in Fresno for state this week. They are the first athletes we have sent to the state meet here to Soro, so if you see them, give them a huge congratulations. In other sports, the Los Angeles Kings will be playing in the Stanley Cup Finals against the Rangers. Game one starts tonight. Their goalie, Jonathan Quick, took a puck to the collarbone during practice last night, but appears to be ready to start. The Spurs will be playing in the Heat, in a best of seven. Game one starts at six o'clock tomorrow night. Let's hope the LeBron doesn't choke under the pressure again. The FIFA World Cup starts on June 12th and ends on July 13th and will be taking place in Brazil. Three stadiums are still under construction but should be done in the next couple of years, just in time for the Brazilian soccer team to have a couple of nice practice fields for the 2018 World Cup. In the Home Goods versus TSOF game, 
the two teams are currently tied one to one. Come down to the fields on Friday at three o'clock for soccer and ultimate Rizzi tournament. That's all we have for sports. Now over to Melissa to wrap it up. Thanks, Kathan. But before we end the show, we wanted to make sure everyone has noticed the safe zone posters around campus and explain what they mean. Here at Tesoro, we want to make sure that everyone feels safe in this environment, safe from bullying and safe from judgment. We want to make sure that everyone understands that they see, if they see something that shouldn't be happening, they do the right and proper thing. So make sure that if any of you see any bullying or any even getting bullied, please make sure instead of ignoring it, say something and be the, bigger, be the bigger person. We want everyone to feel safe in our environment. That's all we have for you today, today Tesoro. Thank you for taking the time out <laughs> of your super busy day to watch TNN. Your one and only source for Titan <laughs> News. Have a wonderful Wednesday.